Welcome back to the channel. Today's day 192 of this 300 days fitness challenge. Today's exercise is right on the screen along with our daily checklist and a list of the items we're going to need until the end of this challenge. If you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to the channel and pound the like button. Let's get to it. Let's take our first break. Discomfort on the left arm, still. I think this thing is gonna haunt me for the rest of my life. It's weird, because it, sometimes it's bad, sometimes it's not so bad. Sometimes it's just fine, and then sometimes it's unbearable. Today is kind of one of those days that it's kind of in between. It's not so bad, but it's there. It doesn't help that it's cold. All the weights are cold in here, so I gotta work with what I have. Cold shed with cold weights. Uh, now I do have all my weights set up for today's exercise. Um, if you notice my dumbbells <laughs> are awkward, awkwardly loaded. Just because I'm trying to uh, increase the uh, my weight. I did a decent amount of reps there. Now I felt like I could add five more pounds to each dumbbell. Um, we'll see, I don't want to push myself on the left arm too much. But if I need to add more weight, I'll add some more weight on the, not this coming set, but the following set. All right, time is up. Here we go with the second set. Time for a second break. Uh, so, I'm gonna add some weight just for the sake of good balance. Where are we? So. Dumbbells are balanced, <laughs> so it's gonna be heavier now. Maybe just a little bit, but it's gonna be heavier. We'll see how it goes. 
through the next two sets. Then after this, we're gonna go with the easy barbell, which is loaded with 25 pounds on each end. Um, and actually, I should make it 30 since we are already upgrading the weight. And see how it goes. Since we have time, let's do it now. Let's put five pound on one end. And five pounds on the other. And that's now loaded with 30 pounds on each side. And the time for this break is up. Here you go with the third set of hammer curls. Here we go. Time for a break. Definitely felt that. That was a good call. Increasing the weight. All right, so we have one more set of these hammer curls. Then we'll grab the easy barbell or Z barbell and continue with the curls. But those are gonna be the regular grip. We'll see how far we can take it. Give me just one second. Have a sip. All right. Time is almost up. And we're gonna go with our last set of hammer curls. Tomorrow is going to be back day. I don't know how I'm going to do the exercises tomorrow. It's going to be kind of rough. I have a lot of things to do tomorrow. So, might be a little tired. I know that's, that seems to be like the trend of excuses these days, but... That's what a regular person does. It's busy, he's tired. Part of life. Time is up. Here we go.
That was, that was heavy. Oh, let's push these weights out of the way. I don't have time to disassemble them right now. Last week I took it kind of easy on the bicep exercises. Today we are pushing ourselves a little bit harder than last time. Finally pulled the pin on increasing the weight. I don't know how much weight I'm gonna be curling with the overhand grip. I guess we'll find out in a few minutes. Just a few more seconds from this break and we'll start curling again. Time is up, and here we go. Break time. Doesn't seem to be getting better. In fact, it's getting, the pain is getting a little more pronounced. is definitely interfering with my workout. <sighs> Might be the base of the tendon there, screaming for help. All right, so we have three more sets. Three more sets of this exercise. I don't know how far I'm gonna be able to push up with this much weight. But I'm gonna go as far as I can. Then I'll take it off. I mean, take some weight off. I'll say 10 pounds of each end and do the overhand, the overhand curls. And call it a day there. Another short video. Let's see, maybe 30? 30 minutes today? <laughs> oh, at least 30 minutes. All right, time is up. 
Here we go with the second set of the curls. Here we go. Another break. Oh. That one felt good. <laughs> Feeling the burn. Let's see where the timer is. Let's see if, yes, they still out here. Let's have some more water. <clears throat> so tomorrow is going to be back day. I am thinking about doing the rows with dumbbells again. We'll see how that goes. I prefer to keep it simple and do it with the easy bar. But sometimes simple is not the best choice. I know the pull-ups are gonna be challenging enough. And there's definitely no way to escape that. Especially with our, our budget <laughs> pull up so far is the most effective exercise for the lats and back. I like looking to maximize the results with the dumbbells. I think it's the right choice. Time is up. Here we go with the third set of the curls. Here we go. Oh, oh third. Fourth set. Lost track. I think this is the fourth. Here we go. Break time. No, I think that was a four set. I'm not entirely sure. Whew. Keep making these weird faces. I don't know why. But, time to shed some weight. Go with the reverse curls. Ah. 
or not reverse curls, but or you know what I mean. <laughs> Now the question is five or 10? Take five pounds off or 10 pounds off? Let's start with five. And if we need to, we'll take five more. How about that? How about that? Five down. is now 10 pounds lighter. And let's see, we probably have time. Yes, we do. All right, time is up. Here you go with the first set of the overhand curls. Here we go. Break time. <sighs> Running out of gas. All right, let's reset this thing before I forget. There we go. That is very heavy. I don't think my form was 100%. I don't think it was even 80%. Good. I'm definitely getting there. I'm definitely getting tired. Biceps are definitely feeling it. <laughs> definitely feeling the exercise. Might be sore tomorrow. And maybe the day after too, I guess. New weights are definitely putting the tension on my biceps today. And my left arm slash tendon. The only good thing is that it feels good. Like this type of soreness feels good. And I can see the results as I'm working out. <laughs> All right, just a few more seconds. We're gonna go with the second set of the overhand curls. Time is up. Here we go.
another break. We have two more sets. And we're gonna call it a day. sets. Gosh, I definitely feel it. <laughs> this working out every day is definitely working out for me. <laughs> 182 days and counting. Eight more days and I'll be at 200. I don't know how it's gonna go with the core body fat percentage and whatnot. But so far, so far I look and feel a lot different than how I looked and how I feel and how I felt on day one. Take our last break. Here we go. Last break of the day. the last break. <laughs> I need to get out of here. <sighs> All right, just a few, well, still over a minute to go. For the last break, I feel like I should take 10 more pounds off, but I'm still going past five reps on each set. I'm gonna leave it as it is and let my body deal with the rest. I'll try to keep a good form on this last set and go from there. But so far, good progress today. I did not know I was, I mean, I wasn't completely sure I was gonna be able to work out with so much weight, even though it's not a lot of weight. I guess until I'm not a strong guy at all. It's a progress for me. It's a big jump. I've been kind of procrastinating this <laughs> upgrade for a while. I've been putting it off for next week and next week. 
for the past like eight weeks. <laughs> Today finally happened. All right. Time is up, so here we go. Last set. All right, that's it for today. I'll see you tomorrow. Adios.